Hey guys, what's up? It's Charlie here, and today we're going to be looking at 10 facts that prove Japan is amazing. Japan is a country the whole world seems to be fascinated by today, and when you hear these facts and see these photos, you'll understand exactly why that is. Japan have various inventions and cultural things which are unique that make them awesome. But before we get into it, why not subscribe and press the notification bell too. Coming in at number 10, we have trains. So, pretty much every country has trains. In some countries, it's kind of a mundane way to get around. But in Japan, trains are very different to around the world, and in my opinion, a lot better. First off, let's start at the train station. If you go to a busy city like New York, London, or pretty much any city in the world, the train stations are packed. There's tons of people, rats, and chaos everywhere you go. No matter how many times they yell at everyone in those overhead speakers, there's a lot of disorder in trains and subway stations. Well, in Japan, that is not the case. As you can see, people line up perfectly. One big thing about Japanese culture is it being very orderly, and this is the case with their trains. Another awesome thing on some Japanese trains are spas on board. You may pay hundreds of dollars to go to an expensive foot spa, but in Japan, you can actually get these on some trains. That's right, some special suburban trains, if you buy special tickets, will allow you to bathe in foot spas. This is absolutely awesome on cold days, so you can warm up your feet. Or if you've had a stressful day at the office, you can relax on your commute in or back from work. This is something you definitely won't find anywhere else in the world. And another cool thing about Japanese trains is how fast they go. Just take a look at this coin positioned on a train. The bullet train in Japan is going so fast, the coin can't even feel the train moving. Much like how the world spins around and we don't feel it, it's the same effect for this coin. Next up is movie theatres. So, from the spas on trains, it seems like Japan is the perfect country for those who like to relax. Well, the same is true for Japanese movie theatres. We all know movie theatres have regular seats. And in some movie theatres, there's also premium seats for a higher price. Well, in Japan, if you really want relaxing luxury, you can watch a movie in a bed. That's right, many movie theatres in Japan are equipped with kotatsu. Kotatsu is a traditional furniture item in Japan. It's basically a small table with seats all around it. And on those seats are pillows and even blankets too. Just imagine a romantic date in this movie theatre, or perhaps a fun day out with friends. Guys, we have to be honest, when it comes to movie theatres, Japan wins. Next up is food expectations. So in the Western world, we're very used to false advertising. How many times have you seen a food item that looks so delicious on menus, but when you get it, it looks a lot less delicious? Well, in Japan, that is not the case. Don't get me wrong, they have very delicious looking food adverts. But when you buy the food, you actually get the real deal. That's right, in Japan, expectation and reality are in sync. Just take this advert for an American cherry pie frappuccino in Starbucks. If this was in the USA or another country, it would not look like the advert. And we likely wouldn't even be mad that it didn't. That's because we've come to expect it, but as you can see in this image, expectation meets reality in Japan. Also, if you look at this detailed dessert on the menu, it looks very set up. But as you can see, you actually get the real deal in this restaurant. Next up is Coca-Cola. Coca-Cola has been America's favorite soft drink for centuries. We all know what Coca-Cola looks like, it's a dark brown color. But if you go to Japan, the only way you'll be able to recognize Coca-Cola is from the label. That is because in Japan, Coca-Cola is clear. Much like the failed clear Pepsi back in the 90s, Coca-Cola in Japan is clear. Coca-Cola Japan decided to ditch the caramel ingredient from their recipe. You see, clear drinks are very popular in Japan, and Coca-Cola wanted to cash in on this cultural difference. Next up is gas stations. So, gas stations are something which no one likes to go to. First off, gas costs a lot of money, and sadly, even Japan can't solve that problem. But how many times have you driven into a gas station and then realize you've parked on the wrong side? You then either have to do a complicated procedure of turning your car around or stretch the hose over your car. Well, that problem will never happen in Japan. That is because in Japan, the gas pipes actually hang down from above. This helps drivers to make sure they're never in a situation where the car is on the wrong side of the gas pump. I have to say, this is massively useful if you're having a clumsy day. Next up is Kit Kats. Here's another food one. Kit Kats are one of the most popular chocolate bars in the USA. Now, Japan also have Kit Kats, except they're far better. In the States and most other countries, we're used to that classic red wrapper and the chocolate taste. But in Japan, there are various flavors, including fruit flavors like strawberry. There's also pear and citrus golden blend. You can also get vegetable Kit Kats, such as soybean. And if you have a strong taste palette, you can even get hot Japanese chili Kit Kat. 
More American-friendly Kit Kats in Japan are Cinnamon Cookie, and something I'd love to try, Strawberry and Blueberry Cheesecake flavors. But the most popular Kit Kat flavor in Japan is not original, but instead green tea. This one I've actually eaten myself, and I can recommend it. But one I wouldn't want to try is wasabi-flavored Kit Kat. Leave a comment telling me whether you would dare to try this Kit Kat or not. Next up is Taxi Doors. So, here's another mode of transport that is different in Japan. We know that the Japanese love automation and order, and the same is true for their taxis. In Japan, most taxis actually have automatic doors. This means there won't be any accidents with people leaving taxi doors open. It also means that if a clumsy person leaves the door open, the driver won't have to get out and shut it. And what's more, you'll never be told off by an angry taxi driver for slamming the door shut again. Next up is sleeping at work. In America and many other countries, people like to work all the time. Some people are workaholics and can constantly be found in the office. And in the USA, some stores even stay open 24-7. But when you're tired in most countries, you can't just take a nap under your desk, even though you may want to. Well, in Japan, that is not the case. Sleeping at work is actually approved of. Not only do they sleep at work in Japan, they also sleep at school. The Japanese understand the value of sleep and have something called emenuri. This translates to present while sleeping, meaning you can literally sit and take a nap right next to your boss. Next up is buses. So here's the final way transport in Japan is much better when compared to the rest of the world. I'm sure we'll get very angry when bus drivers strike. This means many people can't get to where they need to go and may miss work. But in Japan, bus strikes happen differently. Bus drivers actually do go into work and they do their bus routes. The only difference is they don't charge any passengers for the service. This loses the bus company's money, seeing as they're paying for gas. But it's actually profitable for passengers. And it also means the bus drivers have the full support of the citizens, seeing as they're not being inconvenienced in any way. Next up is smoke bags. In many countries, when you're done with your cigarette, you likely throw it on the floor. But in Japan, this is frowned upon. In Japan, this is seen as littering, but if you put cigarette ends in the trash can, you'll also be frowned upon. Japanese people wouldn't want you to do this, as it makes the area smell of tobacco. So instead, you'll find these small cigarette pouches lying around pretty much everywhere you go. If you can't find one in a business, police officers actually carry these around. You simply open it up and seal your finished cigarettes in it. This means there's no cigarette butts in the street, and also no tobacco smell. Check out the poll in the top right corner to vote for the most amazing thing in Japan. I think it's those movie theaters with beds, as that seems so relaxing. If you guys want more amazing videos, check out my second channel. There'll be a link to that on screen in a moment. But as always, thanks for watching. Check out some more videos on screen right now. Leave a like if you enjoyed, and if you haven't already, what are you waiting for? Subscribe to Top 10s.